Hey everyone, Jason from Odd Audio here with another quick tech tip. So I'm working on this absolute unit. This is uh, Pioneer SX 1980. Yes, it's the monster receiver. Uh, it's just in here for a basic service, nothing serious. But what I wanted to show is how to deal with these sealed potentiometers. In this case, it's the volume pot, but you'll see them on different circuits. So you get one of these and you want to clean it and put some deoxid in there. Well, what do you do? I've seen some people drill holes in the damn things, but uh, honestly, you don't need to do that. Uh, if you can get it out this far where you, know, you can get to the front of it, what you're going to do, and let's see if I can manage this one-handed. Eh, probably not. So let me get my screwdriver out. You're going to take the screws off of the front of this thing and uh, it's either going to be set up like this one where it's just threaded into the back plate as you can see it's already popping off or it may have some little nuts on the back which are kind of fiddly but just be mindful of them when you take it apart so you don't lose them and what happens is now, on this one, well, I can take the back plate off completely, and I have access to one half right here. That's the carbon track. That, that is actually what you want to be cleaning. Uh, so what about the front one? Well, all you need to do is just flex it very gently like that and just spray straight into that gap and then work it back and forth. It's that simple. No need to drill holes or just take it apart any further like there's usually enough flex in these things that you can just gently pry the casing uh, leaves apart spray inside and you know it's just like any other pot so nothing too exotic and uh, no need to drill any holes please don't do that because it looks terrible anyway cool unit and uh, hopefully that'll help out some people who've been scratching their heads on what to do with these sealed pots